Okay, let's watch this. Good morning, and thank you for joining us. We're thrilled to share our newest product announcements. Uh -oh. Starting with iPad. This is Wait. the new iPad. No exists, Under the though. hood is a more powerful chip. A13 oh Bionic with 20% faster performance in every aspect of the chip. The upgraded image signal processor in A13 dude, dude, also dude, means- at, dude, at this point, at this point, dude, listen, listen, just copy paste the same conference and just replace whatever buzzword with the next fucking buzzword. The A30 Dual Bionic Intergalactical uh, fucking- well, guess, Dude, guess. fuck the off. The rear camera captures great photos with improved autofocus in low light and better selfies from the front camera as well. It's now a 12 megapixel ultra wide camera that produces a huge leap in image chat, quality. Chat, the only problem with this, okay, uh, I'm just gonna say is that uh, I think there's a, there's, a slight dis there's a slight gap in between what they, what they made the product for and then what people actually use it for. I don't think people bring the iPad to the beach for selfies. I, I, maybe I'm just fucking out of touch, dumbass, idiot consumer. I just don't see people going to the beach, taking backwards face cam selfies with their iPad at the beach. It's no. And enables a that. super popular feature from iPad. Like, like, no, nobody does this. No, 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 you don't do that. Everybody's saying yes, no. Camera as well. It's now a 12 megapixel ultra wide camera that produces a huge leap in image quality and enables a super popular feature from iPad Pro. And that's center stage. Oh center my stage God. makes video calls more engaging by automatically detecting people and dynamically adjusting the frame as they move around or as more people join. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. Thank you so much for the constant content. You and chat never fail oh, to make on. me smile and laugh. Center XQCL. stage. Center stage Hold makes up. video calls you more engaging by automatically detecting people the and dynamically Kona. adjusting the frame as they move around or as more people join in. Another new feature coming okay. to this iPad That's that cool. users love is True Tone. It adjusts the display to the color temperature of a room to provide a more comfortable viewing experience. And by retaining the same uh, popular design. I'm gonna be honest, uh, like 80% of the time, this feature ends up not doing as well as it should. And it annoys the fuck out of me, but if it's if it's well done, sure. To provide a more comfortable viewing experience, and by retaining the same popular design, this iPad supports a vast array of accessories. Well, because including the thin because it'll it'll be dark and I'll be jerking off or whatever, and then it, it, it have a nice lighting, and all of a sudden like it's gonna go like like yellow, orangish, blue, and it's like okay, and I readjust, and it's like and then it's like back to fucking banging my face, and it's like okay, it's just and annoying. Light smart keyboard. And of it's course, annoying. this iPad supports the first generation not... Apple Pencil. And this new iPad will ship with iPad OS 15. This new iPad starts at just 329. And that's with twice the storage, starting at 64 gigabytes. That's not bad. For schools, it's even more affordable at just 299. Okay. It comes in space gray and silver, and cellular models are available as I mean, well. It does a lot though. You can order the new iPad today. And it will be available next week. I think iPad is the, now is let's the best. Talk about Chat. iPad. I think iPad is the best product by a long shot. I, I I think I think Apple's iPad is generally worth the price. I think o over the years now they made the price actually good for the for the tech that you get, and I think the, for for the technology that's, in, that's inside of it, for what it can do and, and what you can use it for, it's just worth the price. Many. We're giving iPad mini a huge set of updates. The all new enclosure features a beautiful all screen design with narrow borders and elegant rounded corners. I'm not kidding. The no. design is remarkably thin and light and absolutely stunning. An iPad mini now comes in a gorgeous array of new colors, purple, pink, starlight, and space gray. Fuck off. And this design features a brilliant liquid retina dude, the, display. The, 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 so With this new design, we were able to- Five new, col dude, five new colors, uh, room dust, lawnmower, fairy dust, and seesaw. Like the what the fuck the is this? All Stop, the way just, out God, to dude, eight point three this? inches, while keeping the same compact footprint. With wide color, true tone, 
500 nits of brightness and the lowest reflectivity in the industry. And delivering this edge-to-edge -edge screen meant finding a new location for Touch ID. So just like iPad Air, we put it right in the top button of iPad Mini. Compared to the previous okay. generation, the new iPad Mini sees a 40% jump in CPU performance and a whopping 80% leap in GPU performance. Okay, these stats and the are never true. And the neural engine for powerful machine learning guys, applications. Guys, take these stats with a grain of salt, okay? You know, these stats are pretty inaccurate. Whenever, you, whenever they test those, like, it, it, it's not... Also, it takes a big leap forward on the new Mini, increasing performance by up to two times over the previous generation iPad mini now has a USB-C port. We're bringing 5G to iPad mini. The back camera now features a 12 5G. megapixel sensor with focus pixels and a larger aperture to capture sharp, vivid photos. 12 and we megapixels. added a true tone flash to mini for improved photos in low light. With a new ISP, users will see enhanced photos with Smart HDR, which improves image quality by recovering details in shadows and highlights. And now, with the ability to record in 4K, iPad Mini becomes your mobile movie studio. On the front, iPad Mini features the new 12 megapixel ultra-wide camera, which Sam. means it also supports center stage. And iPad Mini also features a new speaker system with stereo in landscape. And now, iPad Mini supports the okay. amazing second-generation Apple Pencil, which magnetically attaches to the side of iPad Mini, so it's always connected, charged, and with you. The new iPad Mini starts at just $4.99, and it'll be available in both Wi-Fi and That's cellular configurations. That's good for boomers and children. You can order it today, 500? and it will be available next week. Why? This is the incredible Wait, Apple Watch. It's more than the full size, bro. What the fuck is that? Series 7. The new Retina display on Series 7 has nearly 20% more screen area than Series 6. And it's an even bigger jump over Series 3, with over 50% more screen area. The Series 7 display has been completely re-engineered to reduce the borders to just 1.7 millimeters. Both the case and the display of Series 7 is softer. Listen, chat. This is a really, really bad take. Ready? This is a, this is a bad take. I'm not gonna lie, I hate everything about a tablet and everything about a phone. But it, it seems like the way the way we do the, we do things as people with, with our, our pocket size or not, a phablet would be would be the best way to do it, right? A, a big a big ass phone. Right? But it, it seems like it, uh, most pockets don't don't you, you don't you can't really you can't really put them in it. Well yeah, a phablet. So it's like, it, I'm, it's hard to find a middle ground that is always the right call. You know, if, you, if you're going out, you know, you have to carry your phone, right? So it's like, oh yeah, so, so we, you wouldn't be able to have, have your pad, but you can't have one. I don't know, dude, it's, it's still to have a hybrid, a hybrid. Rounded corners. The new display refracts light at its edges for a subtle wraparound effect, creating I don't know, a man. seamless integration with the curvature of the case. Because I want to get rid of the phone. I, I, I'm tired. Why, why is everything that we need in a fucking phone? A, fo a phone, it, it triggers me. Why do I get, we have all the features that, of, that, that the phone offers on, on a fucking other device, like, like, like a tablet. But then, but then, but then it's too big. I, why a phone? It's so stupid. Stop and think about it. A, a fucking phone. Ding, 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 ding. A, 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 a phone, everything, why? Why? Why can't we have the things that a phone does on a not phone? Like a tablet or something cool? What? And it's also up to 70% brighter indoors when your wrist is down. Series 7 also features new ways to input text. There's a full keyboard that you can either tap or slide from letter to letter with quick path. That's just which a, that's uses a gimmick. machine learning to predict the word you're typing. Series 7 is the most durable Apple Watch we've ever built. It has our most crack resistant front crystal thanks to a stronger and more robust geometry. It's also the first Apple Watch to have IP6X certification. 
so you don't have to worry Nobody about wearing that it in dusty environments. Nobody knows and of course, that it's still swim proof with WR50 water resistance. And use it all day long with the same great 18 hour battery life. Series 7 also has 18. an improved charging experience. It charges up to 33% faster than Series 6. With an updated charging architecture and new fast charging USB-C cable, you know it what, takes- you know Guys, guys, this is my take about life, okay guys? I'm not gonna bother you guys too much with my bad experience, but listen. In my opinion, okay, you know what people want? You know what people want? Peace of mind. This is what people buy, this is what people invest in, this is what people look forward to. Okay, you can't put a word on, on, on these things, I'm gonna tell you what the word is. It's peace of mind. I don't want to be, oh, dude, where's, where's my phone? What battery? This, what, my, did, 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 did my watch, what, what battery? Okay, put it over there. Where's, where's the charger? Over there. Where's my stylus? Over here. It's, did it, you want to reduce the amount of mental garbage you have? Because this is my opinion, okay? In my opinion, it's like this, your brain's like a RAM. It's like a RAM. You know, you know your computer has RAM? RAM? My opinion, life, your brain's like RAM. Okay, and what you want is to be able to use as much as possible for your daily life. And having all these these mental, like weird little little, little, uh, little bumps, like battery life, where's my charger? Where's my watch? Where's my this? Where's my, where's my, all these things, they, they occupy, you don't, you don't really think about it, but they occupy your, your mind a little, and it clutters your fucking RAM. And then you have less to use and you're just feeling not as happy without knowing what makes you unhappy. It, that bothers the fuck out of me, dude. It's there's so many things that 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 are always going, dude. What I what I want is peace of mind. I don't want to think. I want to I want I want to spend my brain power making choices and decisions and thinking about shit, man. Motherfucker. I, what? What do you guys want for me? I'm talking to chat. I hate this. I hate this. Okay, whatever, dude. It's just 45 minutes to go from zero to 80% charge. And eight minutes of charging is enough for eight hours of sleep tracking. Series seven will be available in five new aluminum colors, midnight, starlight, green, blue, and product red. It will also be available in silver, graphite, and gold stainless steel, as well as natural and space black titanium. Apple Watch Nike models feature a new graphic sport loop and Nike Bounce watch face. And there's a new Apple Watch Hermes Circuit H leather band with matching face, plus an elegant new Dublatour band. Series 3 remains at the great entry price of $199. Apple Watch SE starts at $279. And Apple Watch Series 7 starts at $399. Series 7 will be available later this fall and we can't wait for you to try it. Let's take a closer no, I'm look not getting... at iPhone 13. I, I think what we need, okay? Did, what, if, what if your phone, what if your phone could charge all your other devices? What if, did it, did it, did it. All you have to do is, is charge one thing. One thing, one thing. And you, you, you could just have your watch around your, your thing and it would charge it or something. It's fucking annoying to have so many things to think about. How do you guys do it? How do you motherfuckers live life with all this bullshit? I don't get it. iPhone 13 has a new look for the advanced dual camera system with the lenses arranged diagonally. The aerospace grade aluminum frame is beautiful. Samsung pretended it. And really oh, shows good. off five new colors. An all new pink, blue, midnight, starlight, oh, and Oh, fuck red. you. What are On these the front, gods? The true depth camera system has No, you know what? No. Uh, no. That's that's rose. That's fucking blue, black, cream, red. Don't give me this. And product an all new pink, blue, midnight, starlight, and product red. <sighs> On the front, the true depth camera system has been re-engineered to provide more display area. Under the hood, Product iPhone red. 13 has been completely re-architected to make room for new technologies and a bigger battery. This beautiful design is the same across two sizes, iPhone 13 and iPhone 13 mini. What? Both feature a more advanced Super Retina XDR display. It's 28% brighter, up to 800 nits. Brilliant. Oh, for probably was a charity, is it? 
for viewing, even when you're outside. This new brighter Super Retina XDR display delivers an immersive oh, okay, then... viewing experience with support for Dolby Vision, HDR10, and HLG. With A15 Bionic, we have innovations across the entire system to deliver more performance cool, and power efficiency. A15 uses five nanometer technology, which enables us to include nearly 50. Okay, you know, chat. Let's 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 dial it back a little bit. Let's let's go back. Let's go back. I always love um, when they do these little skits and just just take just take a moment, take it in, take it in. They go into the technology of it and they bring us to the laboratory. What is this? What is that? It, nobody nobody works here. Listen, don't get me wrong. Not a single human has ever worked here a day in their life. This is what is this place? This, this, this across the listen. entire system to deliver more performance what? and power efficiency. A15 uses five nanometer technology, which enables us to include nearly 15 billion transistors. Oh shit! You'll absolutely fly through demanding workloads smoothly and efficiently thanks to a powerful new six core CPU with two high performance and four high efficiency cores. For graphics intensive tasks like advanced games, A15 advanced Bionic games. features our latest. Guys, we've been lied to. Me and you guys, me and you guys, we're plebs. We've been playing games. Ha, <laughs> what a fucking loser, dude. These guys play advanced games over at Apple. Buy an Apple product, play advanced games, games. dude. A15 Look at this. She says high right efficiency here. cores. For graphics intensive tasks like advanced games, a15 Bionic features our latest four-core GPU. Jesus. And we continue to push the limits of machine learning with the new 16-core neural engine. In addition to core performance improvements, there's a new display engine, new video encoder and decoder, and twice the system cache. Nobody knows what that A15 is. A15 Bionic also powers the amazing camera system on iPhone 13. The all-new wide camera lets you take stunning shots in any situation. This is enabled by larger 1.7 micron pixels that capture more light and a wide f1.6 aperture. iPhone 12 Pro Max introduced an amazing advanced technology, sensor shift optical image stabilization. And incredibly, we are bringing this to iPhone 13 and iPhone 13 mini. We've also custom designed a new ultra wide camera that will reveal more of the dark areas with less noise. And iPhone 13 brings a brand new feature, what the cinematic fuck is that? mode. Just start recording. And cinematic mode will hold focus on the subject, even when they're moving. Focus transitions happen automatically in real time. Wait. Like from one subject to another. Does an that mean that it's, that, that it's recording more and it's actually kind of crop focusing? What the fuck you call it? Do that? Another. Cinematic mode anticipates when a subject is about to enter the frame and intelligently racks focus to them when they now do. The focus. And when a subject gazes away from the camera, iPhone itself changes focus and then back. On iPhone 13 weird. mini, most users will experience an hour and a half longer in their day than with iPhone 12 mini. And on iPhone 13, two and a half hours longer than iPhone 12 for incredible all day battery life. With all this, iPhone 13 still starts at just $699. We also have some fantastic offers from Apple and our partners, including up to $700 off in the US when you trade in a qualifying iPhone. And we're increasing the starting capacity to 128 gigabytes for double the storage and adding a new 512 wait, gigabyte. Wait, that's, that, that's kind of good. Oh, but there's probably a bunch of requirements, right? Option. Like it can't iPhone be scratched 13 or Pro bugged or... features our most Pro design. iPhone 13 Pro comes nope. in four okay. striking finishes. Oh. A rich deep graphite, gorgeous gold, beautiful silver, and this all new Sierra Blue. iPhone 13 Pro has a newly designed front with a true depth camera system that's 20% smaller. On the back, you'll see our incredible new camera system with beautiful stainless steel trim that perfectly surrounds the sapphire crystal lenses of each of our three new cameras. On the inside, it's been completely redesigned to support our latest pro technologies, including the all new camera system, incredible new display, and a bigger battery. And it's joined by the larger iPhone 13 Pro Max. As you heard from Hope, A15 Bionic features a CPU with two new high performance cores and four new high efficiency cores, and a faster neural engine, as well as our new ISP, which provides improved cool, noise reduction and tone mapping. 
And for these pro models, A15 Bionic includes our most powerful graphics ever with a new five core GPU. Cool, man. This year, we're proud to introduce an entirely new Super Retina XDR display. The display now supports up to 1,000 nits peak outdoor brightness. That's 25% higher than last year. And for the first time, we're bringing ProMotion to iPhone. With our latest technology, this ProMotion display can refresh from as low as 10 hertz to as high as 120 hertz. Chat. We also optimize. Chat, is it like um, like Riot Games where they like probably like file like thousands of patent names that they're probably never gonna use? Like Pro Juice, Pro Head, Pro Glass, Pro Goggles. I got eye goggling goggles. A bunch, right, right? IOS they probably have that, right? This. For example, when it's swiping all between apps or scrolling, the system adapts the frame rates to precisely match the speed of the user's <laughs> okay, fingers. Now, let's talk about the all new iPhone 13 Pro <laughs> camera system. Starting with a new 77 millimeter telephoto camera with 3x optical zoom. Why did you put a your phone on the ground, though, on the table? Auto -focus a and a larger f1.8 aperture with a 92% improvement in low light, and a new wide camera that has a larger f1.5 aperture and 1.9 micron pixels. The ultra-wide camera also enables something entirely new on iPhone. Fuck a case, dude. Macro photography. The new ultra-wide lens design and autofocus system enable incredibly sharp focus and can magnify subjects with a minimum distance of two centimeters. And for the first time, all of the cameras, including the telephoto, have night mode. We're also introducing a way to personalize your iPhone camera with photographic styles. Oh, cool. Photographic okay. styles bring your individual preferences so, yeah. right into our advanced oh, image wow. pipeline, applying local edits like a photo editor would, but in real time as we render the photo. The new iPhone 13 Pro camera system also provides our most advanced video features. The new ultra wide camera enables amazing macro slow mo videos thanks to the new lens design. And the new 3X telephoto allows you to zoom even closer to the action and offers a great new focal length for video. This is really awesome when using our all new cinematic mode, which uses machine learning and disparity to create a depth map that's built into the video. So you can change the depth effect, including the level of bokeh and where the focus is applied even after the capture. We machine also have another learning. pro video feature coming later this year, and that's ProRes video. You can now record up to 4K at 30 frames per second in ProRes right in the camera app. Thanks to the efficiency of the A15 Bionic and iOS machine 15, learning is impressive as thing, well as though. a larger battery, Crazy concept. iPhone 13 Pro delivers incredible all-day battery life. Wait, iPhone 13 Pro la 30 FPS? lasts more than one and a half hours longer in your day than iPhone 12 Pro. And iPhone 13 Pro Max will last more than two and a half hours longer than iPhone 12 Pro Max. Even with all this incredible technology, iPhone 13 Pro still starts at $999. And iPhone 13 Pro Max still starts at $1099. Jesus. And this year, we're introducing a new one terabyte storage option. You can pre-order all four new models of iPhone 13 family this Friday, September 17th. And they will all be available on September 24th. So here's our new iPhone lineup, including iPhone 12, iPhone 11. Yeah, 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 yeah. Here's my hot take. Terrible take, terrible, terrible take. With the new, with, the, with, with all new 5G and, and internet speeds and, and, and good deals you get now, okay, 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 okay. In my opinion, you shouldn't have to get, you shouldn't even have, you shouldn't need to have that much storage. I feel like if you buy an iPhone product or whatever, you, they should give you a, a, a certain amount of, of cloud storage in your own thing where, where uh, you, uh, you could choose or choose automatic features or whatever, where they would be, be sent there, boom, bang, boom, bang, they do. How much you get? How much you get? An iPhone SE starting at just $399. Thank you for joining us. Stay safe and take care. Huh? Five gigabytes? Fuck you, dude. Yikes. Cringe. Ugh. Five.